Hello lads, welcome back to the channel. This is our lad for Set Play Gaming and episode 34 of the Man United career mode on FIFA 21. Uh, we have the middle of December uh, games against Wolves, West Ham and Chelsea. I'd just like to ask, I'm trying to get more subscribers, so watch the show and if you like it, uh, please consider subscribing and help me get to 300 subscribers. That would be absolutely amazing. Let's crack on with it and see how we get on against Wolves in the league. They are in the top five, so it should be good. So United versus Wolves at Old Trafford. And around the middle of December, hopefully we can get ourselves with a week to go till Christmas. Get ourselves a nice Christmas present with three points in the league. And it won't be easy because, like I said at the top of the show, Wolves are actually in the top five. So they've got a good squad. They've got a good team. It won't be easy. There's a quick shot of Pochettino. And he set his boys up today. Hopefully we can get those three points. The midfield battle is going to be interesting because obviously they've got Ruben Neves in there. We're going to have to make sure that we dominate and boss that midfield. Create some chances. Martial spins. It's into Van der Beek. Oh, he took too many touches there and got closed down. It's going to come back to McTominay. And now Bruno... Into Martial, an early chance and a goal. Come on! It's kind of a weird finish, this, because he kind of toe blabs it as it comes towards him and beats Patricio to the ball, who advances to try and block Martial, I guess. But he's not quick enough. And what a start for Manchester United. United just starting to impose themselves on the game in midfield. Into Sancho. Sancho takes it wide up against Saiz. Oh, and takes him on. Lovely footwork. Sancho pulls it back to Martial. And it's two for the Frenchman. Yes. He's had a relatively slow start to this campaign. But hopefully in the back end, maybe in the new year, he can start knocking in the goals. That's a great finish. It's more like the Martial that we know. Didn't give Patrizio any chance. And United now have a two-goal lead. And at half-time, relatively comfortable, you have to say. And the man pulling the strings, Bruno Fernandes. They're going to have to try and close him down. If they want to try and get something from Old Trafford. Just got to guard against complacency, because like I said... Wolves do have a very good side. Bruno. Still haven't got tight enough to him. McTominay to Van der Beek. Into Martial. No pressure on the ball in that final third. Bruno and to Rashford. Good spin. Oh! You could see what he tried to do. Lovely footwork. Five minutes left. Here comes Podence. And he's hacked down there by... Aaron Wambasaka, and the referee's going to have to book him, I think. Yeah, he's going to pull that back now that there's a throw in. Baye comes across to plead his case, but the referee's not going to have anything of that. Tells him to go away. Full time, a 2 0 comfortable win, and three points in the bag. As we roll on now, we're going to take on West Ham. We're going to go to London and take on West Ham. Let me know in the comments, guys, what you think. Hopefully we can claim another three points. Let's see how we get on. We are at the London Stadium to take on West Ham. Um, before we begin, I'd just like to say a quick shout out to Kurt. He's a big fan um, of my career modes. A good friend. And he's actually a Hammers fan. So, Kurt, you'll be watching. Um, I hope we stuff you. Um, but knowing David Moyes, he's probably going to stick a back line of seven players out there to try and stop us. Here is West Ham's team. Fabianski and goal. Back five. Kufal, Gomez, Cody, Bednarek, Oliveira. And then Bowen, Heinen, Suchek and Felipe Anderson in midfield. Jonas Wind is the striker up front. Interesting selection there. Uh, but yeah, basically nine men behind the ball, just like I expected. And they'll try and get something from this game. We want to make sure, actually, that we um, we don't fall into that trap. And that we, this is the kind of game that we can drop points in. Sancho up against Oliveira. Oh, he's tricked him there. And referee's going to blow for a free kick. 
after Oliveira stood on his uh, foot. Bruno sends it in. Oh, it's a poor free kick, that. And cleared only as far as Vlaimer. And now Van der Beek. Oh, it's a poor effort. It's Oliveira coming forward on the left-hand side before half-time. He's brought down. Advantage played as Felipe Anderson looking to get a cross in, but he he's waiting, and Anderson cuts back inside. He's still got the ball. He's done really well. Into win. Oh, and a good interception and a block by Bay and Tellers clears that up. So far, so good for David Moyes' men at half-time. It is nil-nil. They are doing their best to frustrate United and hope that you can get something either on a counter-attack or maybe from a set piece. Typical of David Moyes, really. Bowen into... Oh, he's lost it to Bruno. Bruno into Rashford. Back to Bruno and a breakaway here, Martial. Out comes Fabianski. Oh, he's done really well there. Martial scored two against Wolves. Gonna have to watch him and his pace in behind the back four. What a pass that is from Lima. And here's Rashford. Rashford up against Gomez. He's absolutely skinned him. Has he got a man at the back post? Oh, and cleared before it could get to the line. West Ham doing everything they can. And it's going to be a substitution. Martial and Van der Beek off. Greenwood and Mata on. And throws it in. Bruno out to Sancho. Wide Sancho. Sancho cuts inside, it's Mason Greenwood, oh it's a heavy pass, Sancho into one matter, yes come on, the mercurial matter has done it again. I thought there that pass from Greenwood was a bit too heavy, but matter had the presence of mind to run in and Greenwood supplied the pass to Sancho who then played in matter. Time running out for West Ham. Sancho again. He's had the better of Oliveira there. Greenwood. Greenwood. Oh, good skill. Greenwood. He sets up Rashford. Oh, how did you miss? United pressing for the second. Bruno. Shot blocked. Greenwood picks it up. Into Mata. Into Rashford. Shot blocked again. West Ham doing everything they can. Bruno, another shot blocked. And now, time added on here. West Ham just pumped the ball forward and Cody gets the better there of Torres into... Oh, he slid down and took him down. Cody! Oh, and a good save from De Gea. And that is full time. We've only just escaped with three points. West Ham definitely gave us a game and right before the big match against Chelsea as well we managed to get the three points. Let me know in the comments what you think, especially you Kurt as well, on to the final game of the episode. Here we go, we're at Stamford Bridge taking on Chelsea and a big shout out to Tom who's a massive fan, I say massive fan, a huge fan of the career mode work and the channel that I, I do here. Um, so a big thanks to him for watching. He likes to do Chelsea career mode. He's been doing one, I'm sure, on FIFA 22. Uh, there's a quick snapshot of Essien as we begin the game. Um, huge implications in the title, this one. Uh, Arsenal and Chelsea first and second, Manchester United third. So we need a result here to try and close uh, the gap as McTominay snaps into Havertz early on. Havertz. Everything's going to go through him, so we've got to make sure... He's not a factor. Comes back to Kante. Back to Havertz. Into Timo Werner. Oh, that was a quick snapshot off the post. We've got to watch his pace in behind. We could do with Bay switching over to that side. But now to Bruno. Uh, Sancho takes on Chilwell. Commits him and then goes round him. He's done well there. Sancho back inside. Still Sancho, and he goes down under the challenge from Chilwell. The referee tells him to get up. It looks like he's taken a knock as well. Sancho takes on Chilwell. Looks like he's got over that knock. Goes inside to Cavani. Into Fred. Not the kind of guy you want in that position. He lays it off to Rashford on the left, who cuts inside. Rashford! Oh! 
kind of good near post on Kepa. Bruno holds on to it. Half an hour played. Nil-nil. Sancho goes by Kante. Sancho. Oh, he's looking for Cavani, but it's headed away. Fred. Down to McTominay. Back to Fred again. Fred into Rashford. He's still got it. Rashford's looking for Cavani again in the box. There's the cross. Cavani, it's a heavy touch. Into Bruno. Bruno can eat. Oh. He's a chip shot. Hard to play against at the minute. Chilwell. Into Bakayoko. Havertz. Into Timo Werner. Commits Torres. Oh, and that's a lovely ball over. It's Christian Pulisic. And he scored. Right on the... I mean, we're talking about 47 minutes. Into injury time in the first half. wan gets caught ball watching. And it's basically Pulisic up against De Gea. One on one. From the left. On his instep. And he just curls it into that far post. And there is the man who's given Chelsea the lead at half time. I'm sure Tom will be happy uh, with that. Uh, we've got to do a lot of work to do in the second half to get back into this. Rashford. Down the left. Rashford plays it into Bruno. Bruno looking for the run. It's Sancho. Jaden Sancho pushed away by Kepper. And James will get this clear. Thrown in. Into Havertz. Havertz. Oh, and pushed away by De Gea. He did really well there. And he's offside. Torres. Oh, he's been mugged there by Havertz. Back to Bakayoko. Into Havertz. No! Oh, good save! Oh! Havertz has put it in. Look at that touch from Kai Havertz. I don't even know what he did there. How the hell did that ball end up on the other side of him? He's put in the rebound and we're 2-0 down. De Gea is absolutely disgusted with that. Mount. Oh, he's robbed by McTominay cleanly there and Sancho pulls wide. He's played it into Rashford who wanted it. First time in Marcus Rashford. Oh, he's done. Chia Malera there. Rashford. Oh, it's gone in. And Stamford Bridge is stunned here. Marcus Rashford scored. And there's still time left on the clock for us to pull this back. Well, actually, he goes by Chia Malera. Oh, that's poor from Kepa, that, isn't it? Actually hits the outside of his hand and goes up into the corner. And Frank Lampard is noticeably annoyed. And this is it. 94 minutes. We've already played the four minutes of injury time. And we have a corner. Our last chance to do something about this. There's going to be a stoppage. Baez coming off. Pochettino playing mind games with Lampard. As Thiago Silva, ex-Chelsea defender, comes on. He's going to go up for the corner. Surely not. With no time remaining. We're almost at 96 minutes here. And it's going to be Bruno to take the corner. Come on. Sends it in. Silva gets his head to it. Oh, and Torres couldn't get to it. James clears, and that's going to be it. We have lost here at Stamford Bridge. As Frank Lampard celebrates. And we are not able to gain ground on Chelsea and Arsenal. Timo Werner's the man. Um, who they're highlighting here. I'm not sure why. I'd probably highlight Kai Havertz, really. He's the one that caused us all the problems. So we lose 2-1. Again, let me know in the comments what you think. Did we get any of the players wrong? The Scarlet's team selection. We're going to take one last look at this. What a gorgeous bring takedown that was by Kai Havertz. Slow motion. Lovely drag back. Alright, that's it for today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, thank you so much for watching and supporting me on YouTube. And I'll see you guys real soon for episode 35, some more Man United career mode. This is our lad for set play game inside and off. See you guys later.